Another by Tower Rules. I haven't made a video since November 2nd, but here we go. This is uh, episode 1404. And this is the top 10 W Superstars of the past two weeks because I keep forgetting. Number 10, Braun Strowman. He's just like destroying everybody, even though he lost to the Crown Jewel, but he's still probably going to be pissed about that. Number 9, Cesaro, Sheamus, and the Big Show from SmackDown Live. They're doing, that's a pretty good run as the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions. Number 8, Amber Moon from Raw. She's doing excellent on Raw. I could see her potentially being contender for Ra Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Um, after Nia Jax, of course. Number seven, Shinsuke. Shinsuke Nakamura. Um, he's doing quite well for himself being the United States champion. Number six, AOP offers a pain. Uh, Razor and Akum with, uh, I like to call him Rockstar Spud, but it's uh, Drake Maverick, uh, the Cruiserweight um, general manager. But yeah, they're doing pretty qu quite well destroying the division, tag team division. I can see them being tag team champions soon. Number five, Becky Lynch from SmackDown Live. She's just not a man. She says she's the man, but she's the woman of SmackDown Live, representing the SmackDown roster with the SmackDown Live Women's Championship. Um, she's going to face Rowdy, Ronda Rousey uh, at Survivor Series. Champion versus Champion Raw versus SmackDown. I know Ronda right Rousey is probably going to win, but I wanted Becky Lynch to win. But okay. Number four, Dean Ambrose from Raw. He did a heel turn on Seth Rollins, which was excellent. But I wish he didn't ever do it on night, but it's just like, it gets it more intense, I guess. It makes people more pissed. Number three, Daniel Bryan from SmackDown Live. Um, he did, he, he's doing quite well for himself. Um, he, he had a championship match, and hopefully he'll go on still and do other things as well. Number two, Drew McIntyre from Raw. He's doing pretty good, too. He attacked uh, Braun Strowman, trying to make a statement. Whoever wins that match, which he's probably going to have Brock Lesnar, but he'll probably face Braun Strowman. So it'd be Drew McIntyre versus Braun Strowman or something like that, so Baron Corbin stays out of the way. Um, number one, AJ Styles from SmackDown Live. He's almost there for a year of being a year of being WWE champion, which I think SmackDown Live would be his year of being champion. So he'll be the ninth reign, ninth longest um, uh, WWE champion in history. They're probably going to be CM Punk's record because they want to. Um, they'll do whatever they want. They don't like CM Punk, so they'll probably do the AJ Styles. Then he'll lose the title. So it'll be a while till AJ Styles loses his championship. I don't know who to, but uh, whatever. Uh, so this has been my top 10 WWE superstars of the past two weeks. So let's be leave a comment of what if you agree with most, or if you have uh, other opinions of who should also be on this, or who I forgot, or whatever. And subscribe for more. Hugging rules out. Bye, guys. Bye, bye, burn. Bye.